Well, if you drive a Kia or a Hyundai, you are probably well aware of the big car theft issue across the country and here in the metro. Yeah, so now the city of Kansas City is responding with a lawsuit against the automakers as well. We know we heard St. Louis yeah. was part of that lawsuit. Uh, Fox 4's Kathy Quinn is live from City Hall with why the city says it filed this lawsuit. Good morning. Good morning. So in this lawsuit filed by the city, they say that uh, these thefts were easily preventable if the automaker had installed some very uh, common technology, which they did not. And as Pat had mentioned, this is not just a Kansas City issue. This is nationwide. The complaint goes on to say that the thefts endanger the residents in Kansas City, and that Hyundai and Kia have done nothing about it. Apparently, there were 382 Kia thefts alone in 2022. And just looking at the month of January this year, there were already 105. Now, it hasn't helped that videos on social media show how easy it is to start and steal these models by just using a simple screwdriver and a USB cable. The complaint also goes on to say that the thefts endanger Kansas Cityans and are a drain on an already strained public services and emergency resources. Now, to help, the Kansas City Police Department has offered free steering wheel locks for certain models. In a statement released by Kia, it said affected customers can receive additional benefits and the company provides free steering wheel locks to owners who are not eligible for software upgrades. Kia said lawsuits filed by municipalities are without merit. Hyundai says it has taken comprehensive action to help customers. Now, we've also reported that there are two insurance companies, State Farm and Progressive Insurance, who say they will not cover certain models in some cities. Reporting from City Hall, back to you guys in the studio. Ah, so maddening. All right, Kathy Quinn live this morning at City Hall. Thanks for that.